Hey, it's new here. Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. And as you may have noticed, uh, the turbo nozzle is here, but the hover nozzle and uh, the rocket nozzle is here. So anyway, let's go after Shadow Mario and get the rocket nozzle. Because we, have, have, we can't have access to the final area without the rocket nozzle. And it's up here, right there, where we got the blue coin. With Yoshi. There he is, there he is. So basically what he needs to do is he's actually going is there over here for Dwarf and Nozzle. Unlike Yeah, so he just goes to this area over here. See ya. Wonder why I don't know why we go to this area since Yeah. It depends on his ideas. I also don't get why when you shoot a, a window, the coin comes out, but maybe going to be view game logic, I guess. But, let's just chase after him. We were really funny, like, he lost less his power when I was, like, on the wall jump, like, they go to the end. Ah! Darn it! Oh, get back here, Sean Mario. Come on, I want to hit you. Aw, oh, come on, get up there, please. Sorry, sorry, lady, but this guy is just so annoying. Oh, there we go. Shoot, I was about to rocket jump too. So there we got the rocket nozzle. So now, we now have access to more than just, um, this area easily, no, up here easily, come on, but also this rock and something fails, so be careful, alright, now I've access to this other area, and this pipe right here, let's go in here, yep, so, the final area of the game is known as Piata Village, change time was unchanged, however, this won't be the only shot that we'll get in a while, because basically, um, the fifth shine sprite of Nogi Bay, um, Jalal Beach, and this course, and the same course, same one, Hitler has the same thing. Anyway, Piazza Village. First thing we do is clean up these ammo here. Do a coin. Once again, I'm so addicted to these coins. Yep. Alright. Alright. Then. So basically, there are these chain chocolates. Basically, they're running around the place and they bring up fire goop. Oh, yeah, fire goop. If you touch it, they burn you. So, basically, these chain shoplins. They're dogs. It's like, who let the dogs out? Boom, 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 boom. Who let the dogs out? Boom. So, basically, what we need to do is when they're not on fire, spray them and actually. You need, you need to launch them over to the river. In other words, that water stream over there. You get the coins from that. Ah, you're nice try not getting fired up. You're going in the river, please. And there's another one. See, so yeah, the thing is, you need to knock out all three of these things. Oh, come on! Stupid! Oh, that's it. I know, Flood, I'm doing. It was that stupid other one that made that happen. Please. Ugh, stupid other one. Ugh. There we go. We got one of three. So now he's relaxed and golden. So now we just need to get the other two over here, over there. Oh, yeah. Let's see this guy right here. He's going to be a point, because guess what? Coming up is actually this thing called the Fluff Festival. However, that thing is actually an optimal shine sprite. They're getting ready for it in some shine sprites. In fact, there's just this one shine sprite in this level that basically, um, they get ready for the Fluff Festival. They don't care about a secret level. In other words, you know, that secret level, the Fluff takes you away, you know, you play some rivers, the level. Yeah, like that. So, yeah. Or that's your level itself. 
is very annoying. In fact, Josh Jepson should know what this level is. You know why he should know what this level is? Well, you see his channel, you should see him. Alright. Now then, you can go upwards and see what's going on. And locate the location of the... Oh, there he is. Yeah, the last one right there. So, let's spray him. Alright. This is going to be the easy part. There's only there's another one coming up that literally is much harder than this one. But that's actually going to be in the daytime. In the time of daytime, of course. Alright. For every odd course, um... Uh... It's gonna be nighttime. Or of course it's gonna be daytime. Alright, when it's nighttime, um this is gonna be the only river area, um the river area where the hot spring will be dry. It'll be vice versa in the daytime. Remember, always kind your pets at flood. And before you start right, I see some blue coins we can actually get some opportunities for. Um, the first one is right here, just spray this. Uh, let's see this. Let's try this again. I right, spray that wire thing to get a blue coin right here. There we go. Alright. Now then, down the riverbed are some more blue coins you can actually get. If you're not careful of these things. Alright, the first thing is right here. There's a blue coin. Yep. Yeah. You see a certain guy, see what episodes they're in. Um, yeah, some of these blue coins are only in certain episodes. Others of them are in, like, every episode. Like this one. Yeah. So, yeah. Try to look around for them. And... That would be enough for now. There's another one I see. I know there's another one. We'll get it before. Another time. So, yeah. This trash race ours. 31. Oh, yeah. And now it's time for the next thing we gotta do. Um, now, what are we gonna do now? Hmm. Let's think. They still care about the Aura Place, aka Nogi Bay. That's all they care about, Nogi Bay. Yes, alert. It's been reported that a lone Yoshi egg has been spotted on a local rooftop. This news is unconfirmed. Oh. Alright. Okay then. But first of all, before we go back to No... Yo, we'll go to Nogi Bay another time. Before we go back to Serena Beach for a secret level. That's where we're going to Serena Beach. Because basically, I want to do the... The, the, three, the three and four, which actually have a solution to the... Thing. Yeah, episodes 3 and 4 of No Bay actually had a solution to the water group problem. Anyway, just go up here um, to the Shine Gate statue, and what we need to do is actually spray the Shine Spray. It's basically, it's filled with goop. And then you can spin around. But anyway, go the goop off of it, and you think it's trying to come back? Well, I'm afraid not. You still have to get some. When you get them all, Sarah comes in, and I think a blue king coin just came. A blue coin just came? I think it's a blue coin. I can't see. Ah. Let's see. I think the blue coin just came out of nowhere. Or maybe just that's the shine sprite. Yeah, it's probably the shine sprite. Mm. Alright. So, in order to get the shine sprite. We need to go to the shine gate with the rocket nozzle, so we'll come back with the rocket nozzle very quickly. Yeah. Rocket nozzle. Got in. And now it's time for us to blast off. Alright. Three, two, one. Blast off! However, up here is when the highest point will be. But in order to avoid falling off, I see a blue bird. Guess we'll come back to him to get that's his blue coin. Up here is where the treasure is. Up here and, and rocket nozzle it. To get the shine sprite, and there we go. 
It's ours. Another one is in our possession. Woo! Yeah. Yeah, I know, I'm just so trying to get some serious shine sprites right now, but, yeah. And, now notice the shine gate is actually a little bit brighter. That means that we got it cleared up. Yep. Alright. Now next we're going to do is, like, interestingly spread toes and go in here. Uh, go in here, please. And in here is actually the entrance to our next area. The next area, the area that we just been in for, for a while, the hotel is always secret. And now this one laws is going to the hotel. So yeah, most of laws are going to be in the hotel. On um, some of those are not going to be in the hotel. They're actually going to be out here. Yeah. So yeah. The majority of laws are going to be in here. Okay. A few things. Um. I uh, think. Are you straight, yeah, you're straight to fire your blue coin. Yep. Yeah, so some of these things going down with the hotel here. Let me down the blue coins. Let's go up there just to get another blue coin because I believe there's another one. No! I can't get up there. Guess I'll do some sort of like almost sewer jump. There we go. See a Chojo up there, and there it is, a blue coin. Up here. Yeah, and this no is unnecessary, but I just want to get him just because I feel like it's almost got burned by the thing. And it sucks with the guy. Oh, my Mario, right here, Mario. Listen, uh, I have a feeling you can help me out again. See, those elves are full of ghosts. So, well, could you help me look just as can you yeah, so it's a monster. Yeah. So basically, meet the pink boos. So basically, these are boos, and basically, um, they're an enemy. Notice that they're like sort of drugged to sleep in this game. All right, white blue boos. They actually are normal. They look visible, but pink boos. We spray them, they turn to a platform or something, and they are useful to gain the next secret level. So you need to travel up to the third floor by using these boos. Oh yeah, all the floors are closed off until you get rid of situations, so yeah. So you won't be able to access any rooms or blue coins without use of stuff. Alright, now then. You're at the final floor. Now notice, some of these coins are actually not moving. Um, they're actually booze. But you don't need to get the coin. So yeah, make sure it's moving. If it's moving, it's... It's not, it's moving, it's real. Oh, oh my goodness. Did I just like touch the boo that goes into the secret course or anything? Anyway, if it's moving, it's not a boo. If it's not moving, it's a boo. But anyway, welcome to secret level. Um, it's actually some sort of variety. There's no gimmick, um, like Donkey Kong 64. You know, in Donkey Kong 64, the Donkey Kong Country series, there'd be a gimmick in each level. And yeah. I think there's something here. Basically, the blocks here. They're actually made of Mario stuff, so I would have to be the gimmick of this course. The blocks are the gimmick. So, yeah, basically, the blocks are made of Mario stuff. So, you can jump in this stew that's flying to get across. Like a, a pair of stew or something. Yeah. You jump in these things. Also, some sand here, because the sand, as I know. Oh, yeah, you need to walk up um, in order to get these blocks out of the way. I almost made it in while turning this using this block, but I just want to do it because I feel like it. Alright. There was a sand part. Alright. Now we need to come back to the series after we beat it with Flood in order to get something very interesting. Alright, so. Now we need to get down this gear right here. Something here. One up. Yes, I know. Oh god. Okay, this gear is gonna be moving. So we gotta get moving. I love him, Master. And I noticed something interesting. I die at every second 
I died. I'm dying at, at the second and fourth levels of each course for some reason. I don't get what's going on. Stews! I jumped it. I pressed A. Where's one right here? However, I don't think we'll be able to get up here and get coin. Also off there. But now let's just move on and turn off these guys again. Let's get across here. Yeah, you just do one for a, for a short guys. You don't have to do all of them. You can just do one because it's much easier. Because it's faster. Alright. Now let's try this again. Without dying. And. Here he goes. Alright. And I'm just gonna be. Just make it safe. I said just make it safe. Oh yeah, there's wire on the platform. It makes you do it happen. I will miss it because I'm one, but I only miss it. Alright. Alright, now you need to stay on this gear as it gets across to this to the sand thing over here. Almost die right there. And. So that. So that like, gear look, looks like she's or some reason. I don't know why, but. Yeah. It's just my opinion. And woo! Get the strength right. And why is there a stew here? Interesting, huh? Maybe it's just like a last obstacle, but I don't think it's not really an obstacle, it's just too pathetic. Yeah. P A T H I T I C. Alright. Or pathetic. But anyway, the film pause is great. Alright. Now then um, the next choice right here is kind of annoying, so... There's Yoshi Egg. Mm -hmm. What could we do for the last part of the video? I don't know what to do. Well, ow. Well, you know what? Maybe I might want to show you something that's coming up pretty soon, okay? We're going back to the Ankle Hills after a while. Now we're not going to be doing the next one, I know, but basically we're going to go back to the hill cave, hillside cave secrets for a reason. Basically, um, when you be a secret, you actually get to play the secret again, but this time you actually get to use Flood, which is much easier now. However, there's a reason why you have to use Flood. You'll see why coming up. Let's do it, Pokey. Yeah. Oh, yes. That's right. Pokey's appearing in this game. Well, why do they appear in a... There might be some sort of, like, lodge or something. Like, why do big Pokies appear... Like, even cactuses appear in, like... Probably stores like this. Maybe in the deserts. And I wasn't high enough, so... Let's try this again. There we go. And that's how you do it without... Doing... The vines. The easy way. Anyway, there's a shine spike that's blue, however. Notice there's some platforms. Now, as we get here, there's actually a flood, and notice this. Switch, and here's what you do. Try to it, and Chris, collect 8 coins before the time runs out. So basically, you have to collect 8 coins within one minute of this course. It's actually just like. Just kind of simpler or something. Alright, 4 of coins are right here. And yeah, getting these platforms to get them. It's easier to use this flood in this course, just because yeah, you have it. So yeah, you can get yeah, why not use them. All right, now that I know these blocks, they actually move around, and you know they're on these star blocks over here. That's what they're for. The red coins for information. So yeah, don't think they're pointless at all because. They are useful for the right coins. Oh god, only one more. Only one more. One more. One more. One more. And... Darn it! I pressed A! I pressed A! Well, there we go. There's a death in, a, in an episode other than two or four. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah, don't get checkpoints. If you die, it's all over again. Yeah. See it? You know, one time left. So yeah, if you follow the course, you die. Lose all your health, you die. If you run out of time, you die. So yeah. But the good thing is that you can come back. That you do you come when you die, you come back here. So that's a good thing. So yeah. And I just get across these blocks because, because I want to. All right. Okay, this one does actually cause the death. I'm just gonna get this one. You got to get on these blocks. It's interesting, huh? That's right. You can get on these blocks. And there we go. We actually got it this time. Time is out. We can get this. In this, this then you get the rest of your coin. But now we have to get back. Oh yeah! If you die on the way back, here's the problem. If you die on the way back, you do it all over again. So be careful. These ones don't spin as fast, but I heard Chuck Connor got a fail right here. But yeah. Alright, guys, that's all for now. So, yeah. We get to your level, that really means this happens. Yeah, you get a red point course for it. And. There's like no more events until we get to a certain strength sprite. So, yeah. Um, next time, we're probably going to go back to Nogi Bay to clear up the river. So that's right. Next time in in this Let's Play, we're going to Nogi Bay, and there at Nogi Bay, we're going to clear the river. See ya. Later, folks.